things are popping. Pop. I feel the Delphi way. We're gonna drop it. Drop. On all the music they play on the bandstand. Bandstand. Lovely. Huh? You need a chair after that. Oh. Now, wait a minute. I said, oh. I said reasonably nice things about you, but uh, oh, you, I sir. intimated that you're somewhat of, uh, um, uh, well, I don't know what I intimated. I intimated either <laughs> that, that you can't decide what you want to be when you grow up, or yeah. you can't keep a job, or whatever. This man has been, as you undoubtedly know, in the film version and the stage version of Grease, 97 trillion series appearances. He's breathless now. Have I given yeah. you enough time to get your breath? Oh, it's great. Listen, I, I had a great time. Thank you, everybody. It was real nice. Why, why did you give up the rock and roll thing as a kid? I mean, when you were 14, 15, you had a pretty successful band. Well, because, you see, like, I, I acted before that, then I went into rock and roll, and, and I really loved it, but, like, my destiny was in other people's hands, you know? It's 17-year-old saying, I can't get along with you, so I'm gonna leave, and I'm taking my guitar, and then your heart is broken. And so I said, I'm going back to acting where I can control my own, I can steer my own ship, you know? Do you really think that actors control their destiny? Don't they put you in a vehicle and then doesn't the director tell you everything to do? Yeah, but I, it's either I let myself down or I don't let myself I do it right or I do it wrong, but I can't blame anybody else for it. I, I mean, it. I can argue with the director if I want to, say, you're wrong, and, and he can kick me in the head and say, you get out and do it. You know? When did you decide to make this album? Um, about a year and a half ago, we started the works, and I recorded it last uh, February, March, uh, April, May, in New York and in L.A. And, um, and now it's out in the stores, if you know what I mean. Yeah, you should run right, <laughs> run right down to your local tire store and get one. You know, the most difficult thing these days is getting people to hear your music and sample it. Yeah. Will you go out and perform in concert? Will we see you anywhere? Yeah, I want to. Um, we're, we're trying to set up some promo tours now. And then... Uh, when do you get free from taxi to do that? Well, I'm free now for the next six months, so hopefully I'll be able to get out and and do some concerts, because that's, uh, I can't wait to rock and roll, you know? We wish you lots of good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Jeff Conaway. This is ELO.